it's okay. You don't have to know everything now. You don't have to have a plan. You don't have to put pressure on yourself for things to be a certain way. Hey everyone, my name's Paul, the founder of intralifestyle.com, and today I wanna help you if you don't know what to do with your life. See, a lot of the times people have expectations from years ago, we had this idea of how life was supposed to be. Maybe it's how we thought our parents expected us to be. I can think back of the traditional way that people went and it was school, college, university. You get a job, you get married, you get a house and a mortgage, you have kids and you retire, paying off your mortgage and then you get a few vacations here and there. Now, maybe you've got an expectation that your life is going that way or it could be something else a certain way and you feel like you're nowhere near that. Maybe you feel like you wanted kids but you imagined it to be five years ago. It's okay that you're not living that life yet. It's okay to be where you are. It's okay to not know what you wanna do. Because the very fact that you're here watching this video shows that you're someone who is seeking answers, someone who's trying to make that change. And the very fact that you have a desire to do that tells me with certainty that if you stay on this track, you will find that thing that you wanna do with your life. Just start off small and look at the things that you're currently doing. Notice the things that you don't like doing and the things that you do. Try new things. Maybe you try a few things and you don't like it. But if you keep testing out and trialing these new things, having these new experiences, you'll start to notice some things resonate with you a little more. Passion is gonna come from when you commit to something and you put in the work and you start to see progress that passion is gonna to start to grow. So you might have to be patient with something and have the persistent actions that are gonna get you that passion in the first place. And after a while you might think, wow, this is that thing that I've been looking for all that time. When I went to university, I had no idea at the time what I wanted to do. I wasn't sure I was even doing the right course and I couldn't think that far ahead at that age. A few years after and some traveling and doing a lot of things that I really didn't like, I knew that there was more and I, I had that desire to achieve more, just as you probably do right now. You're looking for that thing that is gonna fulfill you that you can spend your life doing. And it's by living, it's by taking action and experiencing things that we figure out the things that we like and we learn the things we don't like. So just remember that it's okay that you don't know at this moment. Just take small actions and, and take that pressure off yourself and be okay with not knowing everything right now. Because all of those pressures and stresses that you're putting on yourself are not gonna help you. They're gonna make things worse for you. A thing that I really like to do which helps clear my mind and put me in that creative state, some of the things which I've spoken about before on some of my videos is going out into nature for a walk, meditating, working out, eating good food, getting good sleep. I talk about a lot of these frequently because they're so important, but if you start to do that consistently, you start to visualize your life and where you want it to be, you'll start getting some ideas and you'll start understanding what you really don't wanna do and focusing more on the things you do. I wanna offer you a suggestion as a place to start if you don't know what to do with your life. See, I believe that all of us are here for a bigger purpose and a bigger meaning. And we're not in this life for ourselves. We're in this to help people, to create a positive impact in the world. And that can be on a small scale or it can be on a big scale. There's no right or wrong. But I believe when we help others, when we have a positive intention in the world, we feel good in doing that. And then our lives start to bring on a new meaning and purpose. So if you can focus on something that you enjoy, something that involves helping someone, that's a great place to start. But as I said, don't put too much pressure on yourself to begin with and take things steady. Now if you're looking for some help on your journey and you want some guidance and some support and coaching, you can sign up for a coaching call free of charge on the link below this video where I can help you and make some suggestions and see where you're at and where you wanna be so that you can start taking action into the direction you want. So you can start getting some clarity around what it is that you want. Because at the end of the day, life here is short and we wanna make the most of it. You wanna live a life that is true to yourself. 
not a life that others expect of you, something that is gonna make you happy, something that is gonna make you fulfilled and live your life on your own terms. Now if this video has helped you and you'd love to see more videos like this, then please consider subscribing and sharing it with someone else. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.